Well, here we are outside the Parliament building in Wellington, which has been the focus of this huge protest. As many as 35,000 people are estimated to have come here, not just from Wellington, but from right across the country, from the very north and the very south. And what has ignited their anger is a bill that was presented to this Parliament last week which seeks to redefine the principles of the country's founding document, the Treaty of Waitangi. And many people here believe that it's an attempt to erode the rights of the indigenous Maori population. We will never, ever have to decide who can mess with our rights and our sovereignty as an indigenous people here in Aotearoa. We are the kingmakers, we are the sovereign people of this land and the world is watching us here. It is dividing the nation. It's a very big moment for this country because New Zealand, of course, is regarded as a very progressive country that has made huge strides when it comes to redress and reconciliation of its indigenous people. I think it's important that we keep um, our kaupapa, which is our values as Māori and our culture, and it's a real big thing for us to have cultural identity. This is just the start of what could be a very big debate. Now, there's no chance, say commentators, of this bill becoming law, but if 10% of the population, that's about 300,000 of the electorate, sign a petition in favour of a referendum, then there could very well be one on this issue.